Feel like a pack horse. <laughs> and now, hello and welcome. Gosh, the... It's a cold one tonight. I'm hot tenting in this. This is the One Tigress North Gaze TC. TC just refers to like the fabric, and it's uh, tetraline or tetranine cotton. It's a bit like poly cotton, really. And I got the old stove. It's not one of them lightweight foldy up jobs. It is the uh, Outbacker. The original Outbacker stoves. Really just like get that pole. Hopefully this will work out all right. Up there into the middle, which is nicely reinforced. And up you go. And it's got snow skirts all round, apart from these three sections but these three sections is a door so if you don't know if I can see I'll probably show you later like so this one zips all the way around up to here so you can just have this bit open same thing on this section all the way around up to there so you can have both or one of them open there's little tie backs that you can sort of tie them on little toggles inside or what you can do is undo both of them and raise the whole front up like an awning like a tarp I'm not sure I'm gonna do that today I'm just gonna have one or the other open <sighs> the lights not the best it's starting to uh, die down already but I'll just show you what I've got for my sleep system I'm hoping I haven't underestimated the cold from the ground but I'll show you what I've got I've got there's a ground sheet I've got half of me German army flecked on canvas tent and on top of that I've got the outhouse wax wall mat I can stick some clothes in there you know in there for a pillow or I can use this which I've got from Blues Bushcraft but that can be a pillow case as well or a sit mat I'm gonna use it as a sit mat till uh, till later and then I may just use that as my pillow case or I could lay it underneath again for a little bit more extra insulation under there on my core. I don't know, we'll see how it goes as yet. And then I've got this uh, sheepskin. And then I've got two wool blankets which I'll just fold in half and lay on there. And then I'll get in the middle of the halves if you know what I mean. That feels quite cosy at the moment and with the fire going it feels well cosy actually <laughs> I'm warm enough at the minute because I've been busy faffing about anyway I'm going to get that stove just set up I'll show you it yeah it's the Outbacker original Outbacker it's got three legs this thing and these clips they just it just unhooks off there it's just like held with a little bit of um, well, tension and you take that out And then you just get it into position and then you pass the uh, that bit that bit through there and then hook that back on there each leg is the same thing easy enough and it's done all the bits For the chimney are in here. Yep, snow skirts all round. If you uh, if it's snowing, you just get it, shovel it on there. I could collect a load of leaves and plonk them on there, but I don't think it's going to be necessary. Anyway, I haven't had my brew yet.
oodles of oodles. Some Swedish meatballs, cheapy old things just to add in there. They're, uh, what flavour? Tom yum! Chinese spice, you get a bit of oil and some seasoning stuff just to whack in there. Mist has come down massively and it's dropped in temperature maybe that's just because i stopped chopping wood and setting up tents and faffing about but it's uh it's not horrendously cold as yet Let's sharpen this Probably been better quicker doing this with the uh, a trail hawk on a stump. But... Yes, yeah, so another thing about that, it's got all the reflective guy lines, which <laughs> is all right if you're, yeah, if you're. Um, where you meant to be. <laughs> Mate, they're nice, got a nice bit of spice to them as well. Tom Yum. They are quite yum. I've got a steak for supper. It's gonna be a late meal for supper. It's nearly not sort of four o'clock now. I'm only having me lunch. <laughs> I uh, finally have me tea and me brew. <laughs> finally. <laughs> what time is it? I'm in here now. It's cold out there. It is cold. It's not too bad in here. I've got me a little uh, storm lantern on, which is taking the edge off in here. But it's still uh, it's still cold. <laughs> 20 past five. So I'm going to get this on. I think I've got enough wood with that there. And another stack down by the side of me. And I'm just going to... Light this up. And uh, get it in there. Stick a bit of paper, stick the kindling in. And I'm gonna probably, once I've sort of got it established, I'll have a little wander and show you outside because it is, it is, what is it? Cold. <laughs> Might be blocking your view, but I need to get in there and do this. I haven't got a thermometer to say the temperature in here and out there and whatever, but I'll know. <laughs> I'll know whether it's warmer in here or not, I tell you. Obviously. Shim chimney. I've got them bits open. That one. Just to vent it out a bit, because I haven't got a CO2 thing, which I probably should have, but I probably should, especially when the family are in there. But yeah. Proper parky. Yeah, I don't know what, the, I ain't got a clue what the temperature is. So I'm gonna chill out, I've got a cider, a toffee apple cider, which I'm probably gonna heat up. I might do that when I go back with a locker. Hot, 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 warm cider. <laughs> Top of the apple. That should be nice. Well, we'll see. <laughs> I'm actually glad it's got them reflective things on there at the minute. I just went for a right a little wander, and uh, I thought, where am I? <laughs> Lost all my bearings, and then I saw the, these glowing up in the distance. He's freezing my hands. I should have bought my gloves. Just for that little walk I just went on. Oh yes, <laughs> noticeably, noticeably, noticeably warmer. Let's get it closed up. Have a 
voilà. Yeah. I'm not sure. That's the, uh, the is it damper? I can't remember now because it's so long I should have checked before I uh, used it, whether it's open or closed. I'm not 100% sure. I'm really not. Whether it's open or closed. I want it open for a little while just to get it going real nice. It is going, but it doesn't seem to be like really kicking off, if you know what I'm saying. So I reckon I've got it shut. Let's see for a little while. Yeah, I'm going to do this now. I'm going to heat that up. Give me a little transier kettle on there. It's lovely and toasty in here, by the way. I've just been out. I've been out a couple of times and it's noticeably different. I'm going to have to shut the damper down so I don't go through so much wood in the night and just maintain the temperature rather than keep it cranked right up. But yeah, I'm going to have this. I'm going to stick it in there. A nice bit of warm cider. I don't know what this will be like. I'm going to try it. Not, don't really feel like a cold drink, but I do feel like some out, sort of alcoholic beverage. There we go. Whoa. I don't know if this is going to work or how it's going to taste. I'll let you know. And um, the time now is 10 to 7. <laughs> it feels like it's about midnight, seriously. I mean, it is nice, but it does feel. I've been temp bound, well, I've been out a few times, but I've been temp bound pretty much since just before 6 I came in here. The only other alcoholic beverage I've got, I don't know why I've put it in this little pouch. It's a little Sammy pouch from Journeyman Handcrafts. Which is really, I was going to bring coffee in, but I'd run out of coffee. Like, Well, I've got like um, three in ones. And I've just got a little hip flask with some uh, Dead Man's Fingers spiced rum in there. Which I might have. I was going to have with a hot chocolate later, but I ain't got no hot chocolate. But I may have a little coat on that at some point. I haven't, I haven't touched it yet. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's quite cosy. Yeah. Yeah, it's very nice and calming. <laughs> but I'm not doing that yet. I'm not going to sleep yet. It smells lovely. Oh. Yeah, I think that's going to be hot enough. Oh, it smells low. It smells lovely. It smells of Christmas. Do you know, if I would have had some um, like cinnamon sticks and a bit of nutmeg and ginger and that in there, it would have been like what they call it, mold whiskey, mold not whiskey, mold white, mold cider. Yeah, I was going to bring some wine and make like a mold wine, but yeah, let's have a. Oh, look, look. I don't know, let's see. It's just I'm going over there. There's a little bit left, not a lot. Right, let's sample the wares. The wares, the whys and the wherefores are bowed. do boom that's nice i want to enjoy that yeah i should have got a couple more no <laughs> that'll be done oh i just got back in from a little wander <laughs> oh, i had to go for a wander sort something out but uh man it is noticeable <laughs> noticeable i did put me layers on well i, well, I didn't i just had me Took some stuff out of my peeler case and used me, uh, it's like a canvas smock thing. I didn't put my swan dry on and it was cold. I was okay, but if I'd have been out there for any length of time, <laughs> it, would, it would have been nasty, man, nasty. It was well cold. But in here, I got in here and now I'm too hot. I feel like I need to take me jumper off. <laughs> it's like, whew. Steak time.
was nice this stuff kick butt snake rub sizzle 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 smells well nice let's give it a test i think i've slightly overdone it well for my tastes let's have a look yeah slightly let's have a taste mm. It's nice. Better quality bit next time though, but still do the job. Still nice. What was that? Two pounds something out of uh, home bargains. <laughs> I just looked at the weather. Excuse me. At the moment apparently it's minus four. And then it's gonna go minus three and stay minus three apparently until about two, three o'clock in the morning and then it's gonna start going up to zero, to one, to two, to three. And it's gonna go up a bit more tomorrow, but I think that's because it's gonna be cloud cover because it's gonna be rain. So it could be hossing down in the morning. Still chewing on that thing. I'm gonna have a tot of rum. Chill out for five or 10 minutes and go and have a look outside to see what's going on. Yeah, just quickly about this hot tent in Malarkey. It is, it is really nice. I'm very comfortable. Like I say it's minus four out there. I'm very comfortable. I don't even need to get under here as yet. But um, I do notice it's, it's warmer up a little bit. So if you're on a cot bed or you you were somewhere where you could like, you know, you was there for a long time. This is what I'd like to do, is to like make. Make your own sort of, what's the word for it? You know, the log bed. One of them beds and then stick your sleep mat or whatever you're using on there. And then the height, the heat, the heat from the stove. Well, heat rises, don't it? I'm still warm down here where I am. But like, you can notice the difference. When I sit up here and I'm here, I can feel too hot almost. I'm like, well hot. I can feel it with my hand, the difference between there and sort of there, definitely, I definitely feel the difference, but I don't think it matters too much. Uh, these temperatures, I'll be warm enough with a couple of wool blankets and what have you. But um, well, I think I will. But like in future, I think I might try and invest in a cot bed or there. Uh, I don't know which one yet. They're expensive, aren't they? All this stuff's expensive. But then if you're going to use it and that, then you're going to make use of it and it's not going to be sat there collecting dust. And you're going to appreciate it. And it's worth it, isn't it? If you, if you can. My eyes feel heavy. I feel tired. It's only... This one's up. I'm saying that. It's like 10 to 10. Well late, <laughs> no. <laughs> but it's getting that time. It's getting that time. I'm gonna settle. I'm gonna have a little wander. I'm gonna have a little wander in a minute. I'm gonna show you outside, and uh, and I'm gonna settle down for the night. Oh, I can hear things skittering about. It's proper cosy in there. It's noticeably different. Noticeably different out here. I don't know if you can see that really fine there's moisture in the air it's like the wind's coming this way so uh it's uh yeah i'm set up right to not be facing into the wind although i'm all closed in any that anyway but it's seriously chilly <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
nice proper toasty in here. <laughs> it is uh, proper toasty compared to out there. It's cold, crockle. Feel it. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna say uh, I'm gonna say good night now on uh, yeah. and <laughs> good night. <laughs> See you in the morning, hopefully. <laughs> Just had a cup of coffee, it's now about quarter past eight. Stake the old fire up again, I'm gonna have a uh, I'm starving, I'm not normally that hungry this time, this early in the morning, but I'm gonna have some bacon and eggs. I slept fairly well, but yeah, what's the word? Um, padding. <laughs> I was sort of warm enough, mostly, mostly, it could get a bit chilly in the night. But it's not, it's not frosty and frozen out there, it's more, it's changed, it's more gone windy and a bit rainy. And there was some rain in the night from about three o'clock, so about six this morning. But, yeah, yeah, had none come in here, so that's good. <laughs> You want to get me bacon and eggs on? Come hither. It's a bit of a mess, but <laughs> I'm gonna enjoy it. Could do with a little spatula. It's kind of more like a scrambled egg, but without the milk. Still, it started raining again. This a sample of the vares and y fours and them's just bacon and egg, mate. Messed up bacon and egg, but messy bacon and egg. Oh. Um, messy bugger. That's me. That's me. Nearly done. I'm gonna uh, top me water up just so I've got enough for a brewski, and then I'm gonna pack up and get down. I'll show you outside before I go. Well, who's outside this morning? <laughs> it's uh, no frost. It's still chilly. Don't get me wrong, but it ain't as cold as. Um, thought it was going to be. It was up until halfway in the night and then the weather sort of changed. It went windy and rainy. And that's, that's what it's like now as well. It's not raining but it's windy and damp. It has been raining and there's more rain forecast. But anyway I'm going to call it there. Um, there's not really much more to show you because I'm going to have to let that stove burn out. I'm going to use the last of the heat there, do myself a cup of tea <laughs> in there, look, my little abode, cosy pretty much, although I do wish I had more cushioning, you know, maybe I should have brought an inflatable mat or something to put with the stuff, just for comfort, not so much for warmth, although I did feel a little bit of a chill coming through the ground a couple of times, but nothing too bad, yeah. 
and the, 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 the wool blankets kept me warm although I did have that fire on but it went out a little bit in the night and I noticed when it went out <laughs> I had to get it get another log on there yeah I did notice of every sort of two hours ish so thank you for watching <laughs> if you did thank you bye 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 bye